Hello guys, this is uh, your program and Shake. Today I'm going to talk about a program, a great useful program that I have written in C Sharp. It's very easily well done and neatly is called Notepad. You know, everybody uses the Microsoft Notepad. I have written mine with some few exceptional features. Okay, so today I'm just going to explain how my Notepad works and everything. So, in the next video, I will show you uh just uh, the code will be put online and if i if i can put in my website the executable code i'll put it there so all you need is just darknet in your uh, computer install and you should be able to run it when you double click it so here as you can see this is notepad for me it's called cbd text reader and so it's untitled so you can do op new open save print exit uh, the print function doesn't work yeah so it doesn't work so you can count the words you can find you can replace you can out number you can turn the selected text into lowercase or uppercase you know because a lot of times sometimes i am typing and then i realize it's supposed to be uppercase or it's supposed to be all lowercase and i mistakenly put so uh, so uh, that means i have to erase all of that because i usually type without looking so i will have to erase all of that to retype it again if you are using if i'm if i'm using this uh not by this text editor all i have to do is just highlight it and just click the here and it will uh let's give an example so and I say my name is CBD, right? I let me increase the font, right? Uh, I am a programmer, right? Let's say I want to just make this lowercase. I just click here, turn search it into lowercase, and it does magically. I don't have to. Maybe if I was writing a long text and I want to make everything uppercase on lowercase, I can just do that. This is there's a handful feature also for programmers here. Let's say you have a Java program you want to open. Let's say open as read only. You can open as read only. See, it asks me if I want to save because I was writing something. I, I can say no. And then so, but this is a little bit of a bug feature. It's still there. Otherwise, it was not supposed not to be there. So I'm just gonna bring here a Java program that uh, uh, I write Eclipse. So uh, anyway, so uh, okay, uh, trial project. So I see. TCP, okay, nothing. Threads, nothing. Oops, yeah, I have to really do any file. Okay, let's say I open a Java program here, and I you can do count, you can do output numbered, and it shows you everything count. Again, if you don't write anything, it's not gonna save it, but if you add something in it then it's gonna save it because what this does so since i don't want to save it i'm gonna close it because uh, i have written it according to my own needs if i double click on this it's gonna open my own uh, uh my own notepad i'll show you how to do that as well also so in this case see let's say i add something here you know let's say i say okay done i add i add done i just add it done so if i'm close if it was not part it's going to ask me if i want to save it if my own uh, my own uh program it just saves it right away so if i open it again school ideas it shows me done so right here done is still here so uh, as you can see uh, it has many other great features. Let's keep on uh, exploring it and so on. Uh, some of the features it has, you can find. You can use find. So when you use find, it just pops up somewhere on the side. So let's say I want to find poly. Right, so oh, poly is here. And you go to the next, you, say you go to the next, and go to the next. 
and it said reach the end of the X and everything is highlighted with blue and over here it has the time 9-19-2011 and the time so that means if you just spend you know hours writing writing you can always look oh you know I started at this time so and so on and it has those features and when you click here it will tell you oh, I am the programmer of it so you can I mean there is uh, I mean well I didn't write any help yet but it's there so if you click help help it doesn't work and the print function doesn't work but otherwise everything else work the save work the save as you know everything work fine um, and so on so the main thing left here you can do replace as well you can count the words so the number of words are so if you need uh, if you're writing an English essay and you don't have Microsoft Word you can use this because Notepad doesn't count words and uh, WordPad doesn't count words in either so you can use this it's very helpful as well and uh, it has many features that uh, also text edit uh, do not have so till next time I'm going to go in depth how I wrote this and you can study it and so on create a this you can uh, have a discussion in my blog but what you don't understand if I get a chance to look at it I will respond usually once a week at least and so on so thank you for watching until next time